Satan took Jesus into these dimensional realms. It says he showed him everything, all these worlds, in a moment of time. So are you saying that Satan's got more government than this? That Satan can manipulate time and go into the courts of God? You hear such funny things like Christians say, oh, you can't go into heaven, but Satan goes before there. So you're saying Satan's got more of a right to go than you have. The accuser. Satan manipulates time. He's the one that, you got, that Jesus has brought the power back from. When we fell out of Eden, we slipped out of rich time into sweat. The issue is time. Bill Johnson says this, The renewed mind is sustained repentance on how reality functions. I'll say that again. Repentance means to repent or go up to a penthouse to get a different view on an issue that you saw. It's the same word. It comes from penthouse, repenthouse. So I'm telling you what you believed about realities changing. And all my teachings have been about this. And Millie's, that we are in Christ. We are a new creation. And all the things we took for granted, technology, what you're in, what the history of the earth is, is changing. The book of truth's been unlocked. And one of the things we're going to change is time. Time is going to work for us. If we need to get something done in an hour, it's going to be done in an hour. If we need to have convergence meetings where we're in the spirit and time hasn't even happened. Let me give you an example. Roland Burke got taken out of his body into heaven and he was there for seven months but when he came back into his body and he saw the back of his head he remembers thinking how gray his hair was going when he got in his body he'd been gone five minutes he had infused into him thousands of scriptures and 120 world events and was given a scroll when he came back into his body the scroll was in his hands it took three days to dissolve So we say this, it says in Daniel that the enemy is going to try and change times and law. The physical law and the time law. Do you know what? He will change those around you. That spirit will change it around you if you're not governing it. So the enemy is going to try and change time and law. Maybe we should be changing time and law because we are the government of God. We are the ecclesia. We are are his body, the fullness of him who fills everything in every way. We are the sons. God's responding back, saying, yeah, it's time to take back what belongs to you. Time is yours. It's time to redeem time. Maybe you feel you've lost time. Maybe you feel like you've lost time. It's time to redeem time. Maybe you feel like you haven't got much time. It's time to extend that time. Maybe you feel like your 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 quality time's poor time. It's time to come back into rich time. And it's so simple how you do it. Since we've been doing this, crazy stuff's happened. My wife does a weekly shop for our refrigerator stuff. It takes an hour every week. Like clockwork, we've done it for years. Since I started teaching my wife about rich time, it takes half an hour every time. And we don't know how that happened. I was washing the car. It takes two hours was to give it a wax and a polish I was in the house in half an hour and she said how did that happen and you know the amazing thing is when you have rich time you don't even get tired I had washed and waxed both the cars and I came in the house like I, re- I remember I didn't even feel any aches I didn't even feel like I'd done it and I didn't even know a time miracle had happened uh, until I went in and my wife said you can't possibly have done it And there they are, the shiny cars. The interesting thing is someone walking past wouldn't have seen it because you see the world that you believe. So we needed, we needed the passports to come to go to Ireland. So my wife sent out a prayer request and our team prayed. Within half an hour, they arrived through the door at the time of day when there's no post. And the postal date on it was from the future. I put it on the internet and someone from the Royal Mail messaged me and said, that's a bona fide miracle. The whole date stamp system in our country, at least, is rock solid. (laughs) The Royal Mail. We cracked the Royal Mail. I started a post on Facebook about redeeming time. A woman got in touch with me privately and said, since I was a little kid, I've been distorting time. I've been moving through the timeline of Jesus' life. I've had time miracles happen. I've seen the events of Jesus' life. And she said, I had this crazy day where I wanted to buy shoes for my sister. And she lived in a different part of the United States. And I went to the mall and I bought her some shoes and I got them wrapped up and I posted them and sent them away. And when I got home, there was a voicemail from my sister saying, thank you for the shoes that arrived the day before. So the shoes arrived before she bought them. 
Learn much more. Go to bit.ly slash time another dimension.